Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Audio Tips. Um, this is mostly for beginners and new users to Logic Pro. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys uh, how to use the eraser tool and basically what the eraser tool does inside a, a Logic Pro. So uh, let's say you have your Logic Pro uh, session open. You have your software instrument. This also works for audio. Uh, this works for anything. The eraser tool uh, basically works for anything in uh, Logic Pro. I have my edit screen open. Right now I'm in a <clears throat> I'm in MIDI notes and I'm in a software instrument file. But basically I have my pencil open right now, so I'm drawing. Uh, let's say I screw up on drawing one of these and I need to erase it. You can either use the pointer, highlight it, and click delete, or you can just use the eraser tool. You go down, there's some called eraser, and it just erases them one by one. This also works for uh <clears throat> I'm uh, loops. Let's say I have a loop open. So I have this loop. I go in. I don't want it. I cut something up. I'll show you guys real quick. basically deletes it all so yeah eraser is just like a eraser <laughs> works the exact same way just delete stuff you can highlight it and click delete but uh, it works for audio and MIDI notes uh, very very simple uh, I just want to show beginners uh, how to do it because I had trouble with that I didn't really know what the hell it was so I uh, hope hopefully I taught some people some people who are uh, pros at this program probably gonna laugh at this video but that's okay because we need to show these uh, these uh, people who are new to it, how how uh, how how to work with it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe to my video and uh, take care.